Hello everyone, hope you find yourself having a great day. I've got a piece of software that I want to review with you and go over some of its features. It's one that I've used for years. It's called Stardock Fences. And what you see that I have on my desktop is an example of it in use. And it is a nice, uh, very reliable piece of software that will allow you to organize your desktop icons and keep uh, settings, uh, examples of settings that you like in different arrangements of your icons and categorization um, and it makes it easy it'll take snapshots of your desktop view how you've got it arranged the colors and settings and all and allow you to easily restore it and switch between them and this is one where I've got um, I have a dual monitor set up and on my other monitor I've got uh, other fences set up with different types of categorization and different programmed icons and um, it just makes it real nice because especially with a dual monitor setup you can have one that you work off of primarily and another one that uh, like for example I do my screencasts on that I don't have a lot of icons on and so you see I've got it broken into computer related services and uh, file browsing and, and things of that nature I've got another setup for fences with graphics related and video related uh, applications and one for just types of utility you know CD burners uh, imaging software CC cleaner things of that nature but it makes it real nice in the sense that you can organize these. You can even, if you would like, scale them down so they're occupying less space on your desktop. And at this point, when you mouse over, you get a nice scrollability factor built in so that you can um, minimize the consumption of your desktop space that's being consumed by icons and things of that nature. And uh, once you mouse away, it, uh, you see that the scroll bar leaves. And you can size these out anyway. They all snap to each other and uh, makes it just a very nice way to organize icons on your desktop and to create a fence once you've installed it you simply right click drag and you get an option to create a new fence here and at this point you can name it whatever you'd want and at that point you can move add icons to it size this however you like and um, if you'd like to configure the colors you'll simply right click on your desktop you have an option now to configure fences after you've installed it and at this point, you can go into appearance. You can change out the different colored intensities that you see happening here. Um, give it a different, stronger, weaker tint. You can apply transparency to it so that they're less visible or more visible. If you'll see here, you'll see a line. You can outline it, no line, and outline it. And you also have tools that are built in here. Um, different functions, whether on mouse over or what it might do. Have, always have links or never have titles and something neat is under tools is you get an option option to take snapshots of your desktop now here's one that was created the day that um, fences was installed I select that and it shows me my desktop layout for that point in time and if I wanted to restore it to that look I would simply click restore snapshot and it will restore it to that way it was that day that I installed fences okay now I've taken some snapshots for example here's one with the same layout that I'm currently using but different color and different arrangement I can choose restore snapshot and you'll see that it puts everything back to a particular way um, a, a certain style and different look maybe that you'd like to have here's my favorite where it keeps all my icons here's the primary monitor that we're looking at now and then I've got my secondary monitor where I'd like to keep all my icons so I'll tell it to restore snapshots and at that point it moves everything out of my way over on my second monitor everything's nice and tidy out of my way and um, just an excellent program that will allow you to have better control of your desktop management in, in regards to its appearance and another neat feature is if, if for example I wanted to hide these icons from my desktop you can go into Windows and tell it to hide them but this is a real neat feature that's built in you simply double click your desktop and everything is now hidden you can't accidentally select them they're gone um, but to restore them you simply double click again and everything's back you can get startup fences at startup.com slash products slash fences I highly recommend it they have a free version uh, it's, uh, it's what I'm using and then the free version isn't as fully featured as some of the uh, more full featured aspects you'll find in the purchase version but I have found that the free version is just uh, absolutely all I need. And um, After you've used it for a while, you'll discover that it's something that you wonder how you lived without. 
So hope this is interesting to you guys. I hope you find it helpful. And remember, if you want to see more videos like this in the future, comment, rate, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye. Thank you.